What's going on guys? Zach here with Fishing OD and today I'm with my buddy uh, Darian. As you see he's driving and uh, we already went fishing. We're already done. Uh, we got rained out and uh, this video is going to be pretty, pretty choppy, you know. No storyline, no nothing, just messy, messy filming. But we caught fish. That's what counts. So stay tuned guys. Enjoy the video and enjoy the cute footage of Darian. See you guys out on the water. Bonjour, monsieur. Let's go. Go fish. Doesn't even look. All right. Doesn't look what? Doesn't even look both ways before crossing the chicken. I look both ways before putting on my belt seat. What's in that? Ooh, is that a bateau? Look at the bateau. Is your screen even on? This is my who? Are you filming? Yeah. All right, Darian. Are you uh? Ooh, cameraman. Okay, so are you uh, ready to go fishing? I am, sir. Holy Pesh? Are you ready? I'm trying. I'm trying to be ready. Shimano. These are nice pictures. Are they? Yeah, look. They probably look fat. It's okay. Come see. Um, what are we doing today, Darian? We are going to be targeting some walleye and some pike. Because that's all that's open, unfortunately. Bass is closed, right? Unfortunately. 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 14th. 14th? Yeah. Okay. Musky um, June 14th. I'll be gone, so the two best species I'll be missing, but I'll be somewhere even better, hopefully, so. Dinner plate, spinner bait. This catch is Le Brochet. Oh my god! What a nice fish! That's such a nice fish! Oh my god! Big pike, big pike! Get the nut. Don't you have one? Yeah, but it has a hole. Oh my god, that's a really nice pike. Oh god, thank god my drag was loose. He hit right at the boat. Oh my goodness. Alright. What a nice fish. That was such a good strike. See the net? The hole? Grab him. The hole. Okay, I'll do my best. He's barely hooked. Nice. What a nice fish. Okay, we'll get him in. It's a really big pike. All right, gonna go ahead and get this nice pike back. All right, first fish of the day. Gets me hyped. What a beautiful pike. Oh my God, fish. Should be good. There we go. Beauty. Woo, that was quick. What's wrong with you? <laughs> yes, I'm filming. Obviously. <laughs> Corrado DC does the job today, huh? Thank God my drag was fairly loose. He hits so close to the boat. I hope the camera got that. My friend's house, Manuel. I'm gonna say hi, Manuel. Say hi to Manuel in the video. Hi, Manuel. Shut up. It's not the same person. I fished from that guy's property before. The guy with the bridge going to his house. 
I fished there before. What? Did you see that? Yeah. Oh. oh, that's so cool again. Oh, that came off. No. That was so cool. Were you filming? That was, yes, I was filming. That's so cool. Shut up. Oh my god. That was cool. He came back. I pulled away from it when he hit. I wasn't even watching my bait. I was getting tapped. I looked down and I'm like, oh, small pike. Yeah, this is a good bait. I'm cutting the motor. We gotta cover it properly. Bounce in. Well, if you want. You know, I made the decision in my life to take no mustard in my buddy burgers now. I know, but buddy burgers come with mustard. Say no mustard. Please, no mustard ever. It ruins a buddy burger. That's what I tell them. No, pickles are the best. What are you talking about? Yeah, on burgers, it's good. I get them on the uh, buddy chicken burger. Switch to Spoonie. Spoonie the Goonie. People always laugh at me when I throw this spoon. Like, what are you doing? I don't know. I don't know. Air tyrant. Like I said, I'm throwing a big spoon. Oh my god. A huge pike on this. I'd die. I'd be so happy. Big pike on the huge Williams. It's gonna happen. Hey, look at this. How's that not gonna get attacked? Oh, it's about uh, 10 foot here. Oh, like it's the yes, it's about 10 foot. It's not 10 foot. I swear to God, it's going to be a couple feet over your head at least. So like 8 foot. Yeah, but it's not 10. There I am. Are you questioning my authority? Ten mates. Is there a reason you're right next to me? I like it when my elbows touch another fisherman, so when I set the hook, he feels it. You're not supposed to. Well, He's probably gonna ask us to not fish here. He always does. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, what? Smallmouth on the Williams? Oh my goodness. How does this even happen to me? Out of season. Can I move? Can I pause it or not? I know, illegal. So the thing is. How you guys deal with out of season fish is this. You bring them in really quickly. You shouldn't even take them out, but I have to because it's a treble hook. And then you go ahead and get them back nice and quick. Get them back to his spawning bed or her spawning bed. And of course he gets one too. That's not what we're aiming for. This is a pike video, not a smallmouth video. Smallmouth are completely out of season. All right, guys, so we made a move. Now we're going to be trying to get some walleye, hopefully. Uh, we're fishing about 30 feet of water. I know this time of year they risk being in shallow, but uh, I don't know. We're just trying. I've never really caught walleye on this body of water before, so. Right there, Ian? Uh, yeah. We'll see. On the wall. I don't know how I'm supposed to fish it. I drop it vertical? I don't think it's heavy enough to, to jig vertically. Oh god, I almost fell. I almost falled. Wow, that buoy is scary. That is an intimidating buoy. We're gonna hit it. Jig. Fish. I think. Perch. Do you have another one of those? I can't believe I caught a perch. No, I don't. I have the jig head. Can't believe I just caught a perch. Show me the jig head. What kind of can I put it on a tube? No. Oh, okay. Do you have a tube jig head? So I just caught a perch in 30 feet of water. It's pretty sweet. Get it back. So there's fish here. That's good. You don't have a tube jig head, do you? No. That was nice. That was a surprise catch couple of those and we would have had dinner, eh, bud? Yeah. <laughs> Giant. 
And they're exactly those ones, the giant ones that are not Xanders. Fish. It's fighting like a perch. Oh my god. How did I snag a perch ode? All right, that's the second perch of the day. A couple of those and we got ourselves a meal. All right, fine. It's two perch. I wonder if, yeah. I wonder if I should drop down for perch odes. Where's it tangled? I don't know it's tangled somewhere. A few moments later. It's raining! That way. Go that way. Oh, I hate rain. Okay. All right, guys, so I'm not even bothering taking out my camera because it's pouring rain right now. Um, well, it's actually not pouring, but it was pouring and I don't want to risk damaging it because it's a new camera and it's fairly expensive. But um, yeah, we're calling it a day. I know I didn't really get too much fishing, but we're already calling it a day because of this rain. It was really unexpected. We got some pretty expensive equipment and we weren't equipped for the rain, to say the least. So. Say hi, Darian. Hi, Darian. <laughs> okay, that sucked that uh, we got rained off the water. I wish we would have stayed longer and caught more fish, but that's pretty much all we had for today. Still got into contact with a few fish, eh, bud? Yeah. Hey, bud. <laughs> a couple more, we'll have supper. A couple, a couple of those, and we got ourselves some supper. Freaking perch fishing. Okay, so I'm gonna close off the video here. I might. Might. We'll see. I think I will. I think I'm gonna throw in a couple clips, some random clips of me catching crappie the other day and a couple bike I caught because those were from videos I was attempting to make. But the thing is, I didn't actually get enough fish to make a video. So I'll be throwing them now at the end of this video. So thank you guys for watching and enjoy the rest of the video. Okay, nice right into the current. actually might happen the thing is it's so calm today that it's like for me I like fishing crankbaits when it's not calm but it's calm and oh I got a fish I don't know what it is wow that was the most that was the most relaxed fish catch I've ever made oh pike oh it's a pike there we go okay get on the shore he's got something wrong with him he looks like he's been beat up Oh my god, poor thing. Wow. Okay, guys, look at this. Look at this fish, guys. Look at this laceration on this fish. I've never seen that before. Oh, wow, okay. Let me get the hook out. That is crazy. I wonder what happened there. Hit by a boat. Destroyed by... I don't know what that is. That could even be... You know what? That could have even been like a crane or something that pecked at it. That is crazy. Right, I'm gonna go ahead and get him back. Hopefully uh, he survives. Wow, that is crazy. He's not huge, but there we go. Swims off right into the depths. All right, first fish of the day, two minutes from my house. Awesome. That was crazy. He was destroyed too. He was really, really, really messed up. Gotta wash off the pike slime. One eternity later. All right, what's going on everybody? So uh, it's really late right now. It's almost eight, eight o'clock at night. And uh, I've been fishing all day. It's been really horrible. But this is the prime time for me to get into a species I love that I've been fishing since I was a little kid. And that's the black crappie. So I'm gonna be doing a bit of that right now. I got my Stratic CI4 2500. Paired up with the G Loomis E6X drop shot rod. And it's a really nice soft rod, which is gonna do really well for these crappie. I got that paired up with some four pound monofilament, just a little crappie jig and uh, a float. And uh, I'm gonna get my first cast here, see what happens. Shouldn't be too long before I get bit. These crappie are pretty, uh, pretty aggressive, you know. Just a little bit of the ripples on the water will be enough for them to bite typically. Um, we'll see my bait go down here in a sec, hopefully throw back in there uh, basically it's just a little cement uh, cement structure down there I don't know what it is but it'll provide some good uh, hiding spots for these crappie 
I'm hope. Oh, yeah, there. I just got bit. I got one. Got one. This is just a tiny little guy. It's a little guy right here. Beautiful little black crappie. I'm gonna be getting him back nice and quick. Beautiful. Look at that. I'm gonna get him back. Just like that. Swims right off. Where there's one, there's many typically. So let's try that. Let's get it right back in there. Oh, I got bit. Oh, epic. Oh, that's it. That's one right there. That's a nice one. There we go. Beautiful black crappie. All right, hopefully I don't lose him. They have paper thin mouths. Awesome possum. Hopefully it's okay. Can I yeah. Catch yeah, go for it. How do I do this? Oh, just cast it. Do you see the call the cement thing there? Yeah. yeah, you have to cast there. It's raining. That way. Go that way. Oh, I hate rain. <laughs>